I think what defines rockabilly music is probably a youth culture. It's got attitude, it's got feel, it's got swagger. I got a guitar when I was 18. The guitar is just an easy way to express yourself. I loved it, played in a punk band it's my senior year in high school. I really detested country music because it was all that I heard. I went to college at Emerson College in Boston and I started to have an affection for the music that I used to hear growing up. Got really into the music and the scene and from there every time I went to a rockabilly show people invited me to hang out and just became a scene that I became a part of very quickly and really enjoyed it. I fell into a country music and a rockabilly community from the get-go and embraced by it and I embraced it. And those songs that I was learning about and meeting all of the performers who had written these songs became a big part of the songs that I wanted to continue to play and to continue the legacy for a lot of these performers who uh, were not on radio anymore and whose if you didn't have one of those really rare records you just couldn't hear it anymore. I'm glad that people still enjoy it. I think there's something that's uh, infectious about the music that's very, it's just a fun, fun music. So anytime the music is fun, people are attracted to it. The traditional rockabilly music is very stripped down, simplistic, fun, rebellious, youthful, exuberant music. You sing about drinking and cars and women and that's really the staples of the genre right there. You can start a rockabilly band in a couple of weeks and it's simple enough. Three chords and the truth is kind of the stereotype. I think we bring a lot to the table. I think when we're performing, we're performing uh, rock and roll. I think we're performing country music. I think we're performing blues music. I think we perform a lot of bluegrass um, and rockabilly. And generally, I'm trying to craft a show that's fun but diverse, that gets people to think but gets them to dance. And uh, hopefully the the dance a step, skip a beat. Above all, entertainment is the bottom line. But if I can get people to think about important things and to have fun while doing it, that's what we're trying to bring to the table.